Cassini went on to determine the length of the day on Mars. He was only off by three minutes. When he returned to his observations of Jupiter, he was stumped by the contradictions in them. The eclipses by Jupiter's moons did not begin when they were supposed to. They varied from observation to observation. Could it be that it was due to changes in the distance of the Earth from Jupiter as the two worlds moved through the solar system? If that were true, then light could not travel at an infinite speed because it was taking longer to reach Earth. Was the speed of light finite? This idea was just too crazy for Cassini, too revolutionary. He rejected it out of hand. If he had followed the evidence wherever it led, he would have given us the yardstick for the cosmos that we still use 350 years later. But Cassini, ever the conservative, dismissed the idea as being just too wacky. <laughs>